Hello and welcome back to Frog Boy X1 Gaming. I'm Andrew and today I wanted to do a little bit of racing for you guys on the FGT cockpit with the ERS 3C on there. I wanted to go ahead and like change the camera around a little bit, give you guys just a little bit better view. You can see my Abraham Lincoln vampire hunter uh, <laughs> um, thing right over here. So, all right, we're going to go ahead and we're going to jump in here. Man, I've just been like really, really excited about sim racing lately. Um, <clears throat> this this ERS three is so comfortable. <clears throat> I absolutely <clears throat> love this freaking chair. So, I think we're set up with all fifty cars on this. I just wanted to do a race on here, though. Stay double five. Get to moving. <clears throat> I forget. We're going to the. We're doing this. We're doing this. Why are we going so slow, fellas? Come on, fellas. Man, I'm going to be way behind. Go, go, go. So my setup is the Camus C12, uh, rocking the C12 with this, um, 12 newton meter uh, wheel <clears throat> with the LC100 uh, load cell pedals from Camus. Uh, so basically all of my all of my hardware is, is Camus. Uh, my full, oh shoot, the right. the my, right. full, uh, my full uh, sim setup is uh, next level racing with the uh, FGT cockpit. Uh, with the ERS3 racing seat mod on it now with the next level racing um, TV stand. It holds up to like a 55 inch or 65 inch. Um, but yeah, that's that's what I'm rocking with this. I have a, a 40, 42 inch LG C2 as my monitor or as my screen for this. That just works out nicely for me. Um, this uh, this stand actually does. Oh man, I need to stop talking. Car on the left. The race. On the left. But my my stand does also come with the the ability to do three 32 inch monitors as well. So I could do triple screen on here if I want as well. Uh, the Camus is uh oh man, the Camus is uh, PC only so. We are running this on the 7900 XT today. behind me and in front of me and all around me. Cars everywhere. I'm not for sure somebody's going to run right into me on that one. That freaking turn right there is so nice.
gonna start getting going a little bit now. I think these guys are on like 90 or something. So... Love Spa. This is like one of those freaking tracks where where you can like learn to get like really really good on this track. Learn all the freaking turns and everything. In See this guy. He doesn't even know where he wants to go. So I'll go wide. Car on the right. Clear on the right. You know, having a lot of cars on this, man, you need a really strong P uh, CPU. This 5900X just isn't doing it that well. I feel, I feel, I've, I've, I've experienced some pretty drastic drops with with the 50 cars on here, man. This is this is no joke. This game is very heavy with a lot of cars on it. Know, just doing these races even with just the uh with, with just the cpu or the with the ai or whatever that will still enhance your uh, driver rating too if you can uh if you can gain gain places and and stay out of accidents and stuff and drive good and like follow the rules and stuff like that'll still help your driver rating. and that will help you get into better races if you're doing online
I've always loved the way a set of course of competizione is laid out. I love this because I get like some really good practice. Close enough that time.
you still buying me? Trajectory. that really close, usually you can go flat out. I wish we had like AI <clears throat> in sim racing that would like talk back to us, you know, like the like the pit crew. Be able to talk to them while we're driving and have them like answer us and stuff. That'd be so freaking cool. That's what I think sim racing is missing. Is actually being able to have like a conversation and get pointers and tips and stuff like that.
This many laps, I don't even know how many laps we're on because I don't. Actually, I can probably see it on the dashboard in a minute, lap nine. At least we weren't that far behind him. Like we were all in the last stretch, so it wasn't like we were losing tons and tons and tons of time and getting like super lapped or anything. So that's pretty good. So, all right, my friends, thank you guys for watching. We'll see you guys in the next one. Have fun.